Hey guys, Kieran Martin from Convergent Sounds here. Today I'm showing off the first of our mini trailer toolkits, which is called Abyss. This is a collection of found sounds which I've recorded and then processed to give it that hybrid uh, trailer kind of sound. So for example, I've turned this and turned it into this. So if you're used to our previous two products, um, Astraeus and Furiosa Percussion, uh, this interface should be very familiar to you. Down in the lower left we have the warp section, which allows us to reverse the sound. And also lets us change the pitch. Here we have attack and release. And here we have the filter section. We can also adjust the resonance and filters right here. Which gives us more um, flexibility for sound shaping tools. Here we have a delay which, which we can switch from um, mono to ping pong by changing the pan function. That's a cool um, sci-fi sound, makes it wider. Here we have the stutter function which I love. It's basically an LFO that adjusts the volume. Okay, moving on to uh, what we actually get. Abyss contains 40 instruments for Contact 5, but they also work in Contact 6 and Contact 7. You have 10 Brahms, 5 Downers, 5 Hits, 5 Kicks, 5 Pings, and 5 Risers. Let's move over to the uh, percussive features now. This one actually uses the Furiosa script instead of the Australia script. Here we have a transient designer. Which really allows you to shape the sound. Sometimes you just need that little oomph. Up here you have reverb and delay. And these actually simplify to make it easy for you. Over here we have Distortion and Saturation. Here's the Tape Saturation. And here you have a Compressor. So uh, let's move on to the Kicks now. This is ideally meant for an LFE so it might not come across well. I was um, inspired by Jumanji when I heard that. Here's the downers. Let's try and tweak that sound with a stutter. Once again, it's all meant to be for uh, sound shaping. Let's go for a slower attack. And let's just increase the speed of the stutter. Uh, adjust the filter to make it more subby and maybe add in a bit of resonance and let's just lower the pitch and reverse it see what happens as you can see from one sound source you can really make it your own let's change down it So that has kind of a more uh, dive bomber kind of doom sound to it. Uh, let's move over to the pings now. Let's 
Let's change to a bandpass filter to see how that impacts the sound. Maybe add in some resonance. Okay, maybe a bit too extreme there, but I think you get the point. Up next we have risers. Let's add in some stuttering to that. And that's all from me. Uh, have a great day.